You know, when the dream of uh, playing soccer ended at age around 13, I thought that the best way for me to, you know, make a difference in the world in this world was to to teach. So I, you know, was a teaching assistant in a few uh, summer programs here in Boston, and I always thought that for myself, staying in Boston, making it my home for a very long time, uh, would be best if I, you know, went into the teaching profession. I'm a Boston kid. I went to four years of high school in Boston. I went to college and then I'm back here. And so I want them to really get a picture that, you know, you work hard, you, you try your best at whatever that you're doing, that you can achieve, you know, a greater goal. My goal has always been to teach. I've always done something with, with kids, whether that's as a mentor, as a teaching assistant, like I mentioned before, or, you know, being a resident assistant in college. So it's always been geared toward that path of of you know impacting youth guiding them toward you know a greater purpose and so teaching for me is my it's a way for me to to achieve that and what better way to do it than in my own city sure as a first year teacher i think i've received you know support in so many different ways so as a teacher what i've realized in my first year is that we you know in the after, in after school during after school live in meetings but these meetings are you know they're productive they're a way for us to reflect on our practice so we have cluster meeting with our uh, other ninth grade teachers. We have meetings on Thursdays with our history team. So in each meeting, we're working on things specific to you know our content or our grades. So in the ninth grade, we're working on what can we do um, inside our class to make it more structured or have students understand um, how they're being held accountable. Uh, we're also you know figuring out you know students that you know might need extra support. What are some things that we can do um, for them to make sure that they improve their grade in our class? And then in, in history, we are working on making our, our tests and quizzes more aligned to the park exam. And so during that time, I'm working with my mentor teacher and the other two history teachers where I'm learning, you know, how should I phrase certain history questions? What are some passages or texts I should use if I want to do a close reading um, quiz or, or another type of test? So from them, I'm getting, I'm getting resources, I'm getting strategies from those meetings that, you know, they're an hour long, but it's an hour that I look forward to every week just because of how excited I am to learn new things to try out. My name is Renee Reyes and I'm from New Mission High School.